Hi everyone, this is Colleen Francis at EngageSelling.com. Thanks for joining me on today's Sales Leader Strategy. Today I want to talk to you about the power of video conferencing instead of the in-person meetings. Now I'm not saying that you're going to replace all of your in-person meetings, but a fraction of them to video because of two really important statistics that have come to my attention at this time. Number one, Gartner tells us that a full 33% of buyers would prefer a sellerless buying environment and 44% of millennials, your youngest buyers, would prefer it that way. Now, they're not getting a completely sellerless environment in our B2B world, but what this is signaling is that they don't need us or want us present in their office. And we know because of the economic lockdowns and COVID protocols that have happened over the last year to 18 months that our clients are preferring to keep their people safe and to keep us away. We also know that the more away they keep us, the more likely they are to say, hey, do you really need to be on site? Can't we do this by video? And we need to capitalize on this trend. Don't fight it. If this is what our customers are preferring, then let's be masters of it so that we beat the competition in delivering what the customer wants. But here's something else that I find interesting and compelling. Earlier this year, I was witness to a presentation given to one of my clients from the professionals at Duarte Presentations. Now they specialize in executive presentations and this conversation was all about virtual presentations. And here's what struck me that was powerful for salespeople. Their research shows that the average video presentation takes about 75% of the time that an in-person presentation takes. That's because it's just faster to set up, to engage, to wrap up. There isn't a lot of small talk, chit chat, um, or sidebar conversations. So that's in the actual meeting. But add on to this as a salesperson, the travel time, the time you waste sitting in the lobby waiting for people to show up, the time it takes for you to drive to your next appointment or fly to your next appointment. And that adds up to an incredible amount of time. If you can have that time back as a salesperson by sitting in your office and talking to your clients over camera, you could probably double the number of calls you make, double the amount of video conferences that you have, double the amount of engagements that you make. And because we know that more people show up to video conferences than they do to a real sales meeting, you're gonna get even more bang for your buck because you'll be engaging with more people. So do what the clients want and the fact that it's more efficient, effective and productive for us, I think you've got to win. And I'd encourage you to be adding more video conferencing and taking away some of your live sales meetings every single week that you're working. Thanks so much for joining me on today's Sales Leader Strategy. For more in-depth discussions on topics just like this and for more videos, you can visit us now at EngageSelling.com.